personal hotspot transforms your Verizon phone into a portable Wi-Fi router, allowing you to share your cellular data connection with other devices like laptops, tablets, and other smartphones. To enable personal hotspot on an iPhone, start by opening the Settings app. Navigate to Personal Hotspot, which may also be found under Cellular Settings on some iOS versions. For Android devices, the process varies slightly depending on your phone model. Most commonly, go to Settings, then Connections, then Mobile Hotspot and Tethering. On some devices, you'll find it under Network and Internet, then Hotspot and Tethering. Once you find the Mobile Hotspot option, turn it on and configure your network name and password. Make sure to set a strong password to secure your connection. To connect other devices to your hotspot, simply open the Wi-Fi settings on the device you want to connect. Look for your phone's hotspot network name in the available networks list. Select it and enter the password you configured. Understanding your Verizon data plan is crucial for effective hotspot usage. Different plans offer varying amounts of high-speed hotspot data before speeds are reduced. The unlimited ultimate plan provides 200 gigabytes of high-speed hotspot data per month. After reaching this limit, your hotspot speeds will be reduced to 6 megabits per second. For the fastest hotspot speeds, you need 5G ultra-wideband coverage. This requires a compatible phone, a plan with 5G access, and being in a 5G ultra-wideband coverage area. Be mindful of your data usage to avoid overage charges or throttled speeds. Monitor your hotspot usage regularly, especially when streaming video or downloading large files. Some Verizon users have reported hotspot connectivity issues after updating to Android 14. If you experience problems, check Verizon's support website for available workarounds and solutions.